Hey there, it's Alicia, and today I am going to share the three biggest style struggles that women talk to me about, okay? So number one, this is these are the three biggest style struggles that women consistently tell me that they're, they're frustrated with, all right? Number one, I'm stuck wearing the same thing all the time. Number two, I don't know how to dress stylish and feel comfortable. And number three, I don't think I ever look good in my clothes or... I'm not really sure how to tell when I look good in my clothes. If you can relate to any of these three style frustrations, then definitely watch the video because I'm going to share the solution. This way you can feel confident and love how you look. All right, so let's get started. Let's start with style struggle number one. I'm stuck wearing the same thing all the time, okay? So I have a client, we recently worked together and she came to me with this exact struggle. She said that she was stuck wearing all black all the time. All right, and just a side note, if you're wearing the same thing all the time and it doesn't bother you, then that's not a problem, right? Then if you're feeling content and wearing repeat outfits or the same style of clothing all the time, it's not a problem. It's an issue when you don't want to be wearing the same thing all the time, okay? And so that's what was going on with my client. She realized that she was wearing all black all the time and it's not what she wanted to do, okay? So interestingly enough, when my client and I, when we started working together, she said, I have nothing in my wardrobe. I have no clothes, all right? That is what she told me, okay? Then we took a closer look at her wardrobe and we rediscovered so many hidden gems, right? So she just got into that habit of going into her closet to get dressed and she would just bypass. It was like these items of clothing, she would just pass right by them and not even see them because she'd gotten into such a habit of wearing the same thing. So it was like her brain was just going to the same black pieces all the time and anything else that didn't fit into the black pieces, she didn't even see it, all right? So that's what was happening with her is she was overlooking so many items in her wardrobe. And when we got into her closet, we saw, wow, you've actually got a lot of stuff. And she told me how surprised she was at how many amazing outfits she was able to put together with stuff that she already owns that felt fresh and felt new and they felt exciting to her. So I'm actually gonna show you a picture of what this client is looking like these days. Okay, so there she was wearing her all black all the time, all right? And now she is feeling so much more inspired, so much more invigorated. She's got her, she's inspiration, she's inspired again, right? That's what she said to me is that she's like, re, um, she feels refreshed, right? It's like, it was almost like she was in a, a, a hiding by wearing all black all the time. It was, she just put the same thing on every day. It was like, she didn't want to be seen. And now she says that she told me one time that she was going just to run a really simple errand. And normally she would have gone in and, and sort of been hiding in how she was going in to do her errands. But this time now with her new outfits, she struts in and she feels confident and she's just having so much more fun with everything in her life, okay? So that is style struggle number one, okay? So the solution is to just get into your closet and revisit everything that you have, okay? Because you may be surprised at what's in there and how it just needs to be put together in a new and exciting way, all right? Let's move on to style frustration number two, okay? So this is if you don't know how to put together your outfits so that you look stylish and feel comfortable. So I understand the need to feel comfortable. Trust me, I understand the need to feel comfortable. I really, I've had that need for a long, long time. And I know for many of us, the pandemic has really um, taken that to a new level. We got so used to wearing comfortable clothes that our toleration for something that is uncomfortable or not super comfortable has just gotten really low, right? We have very little tolerance to feel uncomfortable in our clothes. And I totally understand that, okay? But here's the deal. You can look stylish and you can feel comfortable. It is 100% possible. 
Okay. So the way that you do that is number one, you always want to choose your fabrics carefully. So only wear comfortable fabrics. Okay. So if you're thinking that your jeans now feel too hard and uncomfortable, do not wear the jeans. All right. So look for fabrics that feel comfortable. And then the second thing you want to do is you want to put together complete outfits. You want your outfit to feel whole. All right. Because what happens is, is you just get dressed and you're not putting together whole outfits. So this is what my client was doing. This is another client, another woman who I worked with. And she had this idea, actually, you know what? I'm going to just show you the photo of her right now so that you can see exactly what I'm talking about. Okay. So here, so she, she loved to feel comfortable. Okay. That was really important to her. And she also wanted to look stylish. So when we first started working together, she thought that the style comes from the fashion details in the garment, okay? So she thought that it was what she was wearing that made the outfit stylish. But really, the truth is, it's not what you wear, it's how you wear it. So she would find a top that had rouging or ruffles, right? Or it would be um, off the shoulder. And she thought, oh, okay, it's, it's this garment and it's got all of those details then I'm going to look stylish. But that's not true because you look stylish. Looking stylish depends on how you wear your garments, right? You can't just pick up one piece of clothing and, and be stylish, right? It's how you combine that piece with the rest of your outfit. All right, so that's exactly what we did. We put her clothes together in new and inspirational ways, okay? And the other big thing, the big change that we made with her style was that we put her outfits together as whole outfits, okay? So we included three style elements to make a complete outfit, okay? So the outfit on the right, do you see how she's got uh, three style elements there? And I just on a side note, you don't have to wear a jacket or a cardigan to complete your outfit, okay? There's other ways to do that. And that is exactly what she's doing in the outfit with the pink peplum top, okay? And that's actually really helpful as, as the weather gets hotter, you might not wanna wear a third piece, a jacket or a cardigan, right? So there's other ways to complete your outfit, all right? So the important thing to know if you feel like you can't put together stylish outfits and feel comfortable to always choose really comfortable fabrics and then put together whole outfits, okay? Don't focus just on what you're wearing. Put your intention into how you're wearing it, all right? Let us move on to style frustration number three, okay? And style frustration number three has to do with when you think that nothing looks good on you or you don't know what looks good on you, right? Or you don't know how, you can't tell, right? You just don't know what looks right, okay? So this could come, maybe you, maybe your body shape has changed recently. Maybe you've gained weight, maybe you've lost weight, or maybe you never really knew how to compliment your body in the first place. So what you end up doing, and I say you, but I, I see this a lot with so many women because they don't know how to compliment their body shape and they're not really sure what looks good on them they wear oversized items, right? They just decide to hide their body and they think that's the solution, okay? Let me just tell you that hiding your body is not the solution, okay? Number one, your body is not the problem, okay? That is not the problem. So hiding it is not the solution, okay? So the way that you wanna solve this problem is you want to experiment and you want to find the styles, find the silhouettes, that suit your body, okay? So again, it's about how you put your clothes together, all right? So let me show you um, another example. This is my client over here, all right? So she definitely wasn't sure how to suit her body, okay? And so she just would take oversized pieces and think that that was, that was the way to dress, right? She thought that that was, making her look her best, okay? But the truth is, is that she needed to explore, she needed to experiment, she needed to know what styles, what silhouettes complement her particular body shape, okay? So what we discovered was highlighting her waist was actually incredibly 
flattering for her. And when she saw pictures of herself, she saw how flattering that was, right? She doesn't feel the need that she has to keep hiding her body anymore, okay? So it's really just about understanding how to style yourself, okay? What clothes, what styles, what silhouettes are going to complement you best, all right? So if you think that you never look good in your clothes, then you need to experiment and you need to find the right styles that work for your body. And if you're not sure what looks good, then you need to listen in. You need to tune into your body because your body always speaks the truth, okay? So when you try something on, you listen to your body and you wanna understand, you wanna know how you feel, okay? So you try it on and if you put something on and it feels tight and it feels constricted and it feels uncomfortable, don't wear it, okay? It doesn't look good. If you put something else on and it feels really free and you feel really confident and you feel inspired, wear it. That looks good, okay? So always tune into your body to know when something looks right, okay? Because your body always speaks the truth, all right? So those are the three solutions to the biggest style struggles. You wanna get in your closet and you want to rediscover what you have and you wanna put it together in new and inspiring ways, okay? You also want to pay less attention to what you're wearing and more attention to how you're wearing it, okay? You want to put together whole looks, okay? And lastly, you want to experiment with different styles and different silhouettes that complement your body so that you don't feel compelled to hide your body anymore, okay? So if you want help implementing all three of these solutions, then you got to get inside my styling bootcamp because this is exactly what we are going to do, okay? It's called 21 Day Outfit Innovation. And in this program, you are are going to get in your closet and you're going to rediscover all the hidden gems and you're going to learn new and fresh ways to put your clothes together, okay? You are going to gain a thorough understanding of how to put your uh, how to put your outfits together based on the advanced styling strategies that I'm going to share with you. Okay, so these are the styling secrets that I use with my private clients, and I use them on the commercial shoots that I do in New York City. Okay, so your styling skills are going to go, they're going to skyrocket. All right, you are going to feel so confident in putting your outfits together, and people are going to notice. And you're also going to experiment with the different styles and the different silhouettes that suit your particular body. So so you don't feel compelled to hide anymore, okay? So I encourage you to join this boot camp if you're ready to take your style to the next level and start feeling confident in how you're showing up this summer, okay? You're gonna reimagine your summer style in a completely new and exciting way, all right? So go to alishalankin.com forward slash innovate. That's where you'll get all the details and sign up, all right? So that's what I wanted to share with you today and I will see you soon. Okay, bye.